Hello everyone, this is Jim Lunt Lawyer here for Recycling News. We're live covering tonight's NorCal Tuesday Nighter, the Redland Stage 1, Crafton Hills. It's an 18 or 14 mile course, uh, approximately 1,300 feet of climb, and it's new for the NorCal Tuesday Nighter. It's a stage race with a weekly stages. The Redlands Classic. It's the longest running elite stage race left in the U.S. The Redlands features hilly stages in Southern California around Redlands east of Los Angeles. At the end of five weeks we will post a uh, standings and no need to uh, race every one. So this will be stage one tonight and we've got a lot of great racers joining us tonight so it should be a great great time. Again, you're watching live coverage on B-Cycling News. Thank you. Got all of the racers lined up here at the start. Uh, got Dan Connolly, the one that sets all this NorCal stuff up. We appreciate him. I see Shane out there, D. Bodke. And I'm sure others will join here shortly. Should be a great race night. The uh, course is flat and then a downhill to the middle. It's an out and back course basically. So when we hit the middle, they're going to do a turnaround and come back. So what they ride down, they're going to ride back up. Two minutes to go before the race starts. Little over a minute to the start of the race night. Racing the NorCal Tuesday Nighter Redlands Stage 1, Crafton Hills. 14 miles out and back, about 1,300 feet total climb. Lots of great racers out here, here tonight. Shane D. Connolly, D. Bodke, Brian Kellison, April Regal, and a lot of bods out here tonight. So. We will try to go around them and uh, give you accurate reporting on the positions of our real life riders. 30 seconds. Twenty seconds to the start of the NorCal Tuesday Nighter Redland Stage One race. And they're off. Got D. Bodke, Tristan Witt, M. Saccone, Peanut, all jumping out to the front. M. Saccone's out front right now doing a great job. D. Bodke in a close second. Tristan Witt third, Peanut fourth, B. Kellison fifth, J. Giannone in sixth. B. Richwine in 7th, M. Wall in 8th right now, Shane in ninth. J. Bobay in 10th. All racing very hard, doing a great job. Looks like Peanut is jumping out front right now. M. Saccone says, nope, going to take it back.
Fast pace rates to start, 26 miles an hour, 27, 4% grade downhill right now, going to be flying 40 miles an hour, great racing up front, first four people are within three yards of each other, battling for that lead position. All in the red zone right now on a slight climb, 1%. Pushing hard, 200 plus watts. M. Sacone in first right now. Peanut taking that. Tristan Witt jumping up front. Got some great racing going on on the NorCal Tuesday night or Redland Stage 1 race. Got a big group up front. D. Bodke, second place. B. Callison out in first. M. Sacone now taking that spot. D. Bodke drops a second. Oh, we got a little flyer by somebody. Who is it? Peanut jumping out front. Everybody's fighting for that first position. Peanut doing a little flyer. Got about 10 yard lead on second through sixth right or seventh right now. Doing a great job. We got seven people in that front group. All battling it out. In a nice downhill section, 5% downhill, 35 miles an hour, everybody putting out the wattage, keeping it going. Jockeying for that first position. As you can see on the bottom on the elevation profile, downhill to the middle and then they do a turnaround and head back. And then they've got this, where they're riding now, the downhill, they'll be climbing back up towards the finish. A little over a mile and a half in, 12 to go. Got some great racing going on, and you see, uh, looks like uh, Peanut is there taking advantage of the draft and coasting down this hill and staying with the pack because of the draft. Great, great job. Smart racing by Peanut. Carrying that speed down the hill. Got M. Sacone back out front. Got some people attacking. B. Richwine. D. Bodke. M. Sacone jumping back out front. Doing a great job. All of our racers tonight are excellent, excellent racing. Thanks to all of them for joining us. J. Bervais jumping out front right now. D. Bodke on his wheel. M. Sacone jumping out front. Lots of jockeying. There's B. Kellison in his normal red, white, and blue American flag jersey. Great racing. Almost three miles complete. 28 mile an hour right now on this section of the course. Still in a slight downhill, 2%. Peanut has got about a 20 yard lead over second right now. And then second through seventh are all about 14, 15 yards back from Peanut right now. All working together to reel him back in. And there they come.
Got to see who's got the uh, climbing legs tonight on this finish because we will have a long, steady climb to the finish tonight on this course. And it will look familiar to our riders because this is where they're at now, going out and then going to do a turnaround and come back at it to the finish. Great racing night, live coverage on B Cycling News. And we're racing on the RGT Cycling Platform, a great platform for virtual cycling. cycling. Great bike, dy bike dynamics, easy for me to say. And physics, uh, probably the most realistic one that I've ridden so far. Excellent platform. And you can join in on these NorCal Tuesday Nighters. For free, just head over to rgtcycling.com, download the app on your preferred device, whether it be Windows, Mac, Android, iPhone, and sign up for free, and then uh, head over to the uh, events tab, and search for NorCal. And there we are, halfway, turning around. A little less than halfway. That was the turnaround. So, four miles in. Great racing still going on. Going to start our long, steady climb to the finish line. B. Rich Wine out front. M. Sacone second. Tristan Witt third. Well, fourth now. B. Kelson in third. All jockeying for position. Lots of great racing going on here tonight. Let's get back to our second big group and see who's back there. Right now, uh, about uh, 150 yards back, this group is led by D. Connolly. Then we've got M. Wall in 10th. R. Guerrero in 11th. C. Quinar, I, I'm probably messing that up, but hopefully not. Uh, in 11th, right, right there with R. Guerrero. J. Giannone in 13th. J. Valley in 14th. Then we've got Bots back here. April Regal back there in 15th. Doing a great job. Back up front with B. Richwine. And he's got about a 20-yard lead over second, which is J. Bay right now. So right now, up front, we've got B. Richwine, J. Bay, B. Kellison, P. Nutt, Tristan Witt, D. Bodke, M. Sacone. Then Shane, D. Connolly, M. Law, and C. Swine, Quinar, maybe? You'll have to send me a message and... Give me some pronunciation on that, please. B. Richine holding first place. B. Kellison in second right now, about 20 yards back. Then we jump up 40 yards back to Jaber Bay. Almost to the tenth mile back, Peanut and D. Bodke, Tristan Witt, and then D. Connolly, M. Sacone, Shane, M. Wass. All doing great racing night on the NorCal Tuesday night or Redland Stage 1 race. 
A little over five miles to complete. A little under nine miles to go. On that steady climb to the finish. Running about 300 watts up front with B. Richwine and B. Kellison. B. Kellison right on B. Richwine's wheel. Taking a look. Maybe going to make a pass here. Coming up side. And B. B. Kellison in first place right now. B. Richwine going to grab the wheel and take the draft. Maybe. Nope. Pulling back out front. Looks like our front two are going to ride side by side. Neither one wants to give the other some advantage with the draft, it looks like. As I say that, B. Richwine pulls up on B. Callison's wheel in a nice draft, saving about 40 watts right now. Yeah, definitely. B. Kellison jumping out, putting out 400 watts, pulling away a little bit. Getting to a 5% grade right now, uphill. Going to start seeing lots of wattage come up. So it looks like the first two have pulled a huge lead over third right now, about 100 yards. And then we slowly fall back about a tenth of a mile, and then two tenths, and then back to a half mile between all of our riders up front. The first 11 spots are all within a half mile though. B. Kellison doing a great job on this climb. Staying very steady at 400 watts. Nice cadence. Heart rate coming up in the zone 1 area. Pushed out about 160 beats a minute. Another view of our front two leaders. B. Kellison in first, B. Richwine in second. Almost a 6% climb right now. Have slowed the pace down to about 13 miles an hour due to the climbing. Doing a great job putting out the wattage though. Let's go ahead and go down through our standings right now. We've got B. Kellison in first, B. Richwine in second, J. Brubay in third, P. Nutt in fourth, D. Bodke, well, D. Connolly in fifth now, D. Bodke in sixth, Tristan Witt in seventh, Shane in eighth, M. Waugh in ninth, M. Saccone in tenth. C. Quinar in 11th, R. Guerrero in 12th, J. Giannone in 13th, get past these bots, J. Valley in 14th, more bots, April Regal in 15th, looks like she's the only woman again in tonight's field, doing a great job, back up front with our leaders. And I apologize tonight, we don't have any of the live cams. I had a, uh, some network equipment go down and fail earlier today. And haven't had a chance to get it replaced and resolved. We'll be back full boat next Tuesday night. With some more live coverage of the exciting race series, NorCal Tuesday Nighter Redlands Stage Race. And all brought to you live on V Cycling News. Almost six and a half miles in. Seven to go.
And I kind of apologize. It looks like we make two laps of this course. So we will be doing the downhill and the uphill section again before the finish. Great racing though. Live coverage on V-Cycling News. Looking at our front runners, B. Kellison and B. Richwine. Doing a great job up front. Putting out the wattage right now. 350, 400 watts. Excellent effort. Heart rate's up there in the 160s. High zone 1. Showing they're really working it. Pushing hard. Run down through our board right now. We've got B. Kellison up in first, B. Richwine in second, J. Bay in third, P. Nutt in fourth, D. Connolly in fifth, D. Bodke in sixth, Tristan Witt in seventh, Shane in eighth, M. Waugh in ninth, M. Saccone in tenth, C. Quinar in eleventh. Great racing tonight. And again, you're watching live coverage of the NorCal Tuesday Nighter Redland Stage 1, Crafton Hills, live on V-Cycling News. Looks like everybody's settled down into a good position right now. And B. Richwine jumping out front now, taking the lead. B. Kellison going to sit on his wheel, maybe? And there's B. Kellison coming up. Again, side by side, back into the lead. And back to the downhill area. Picking up the pace, picking up the speed. B. Richwine in first, B. Kellison in second, Jaber Bay in third, D. Connolly in fourth. Great racing, great efforts by all of our riders tonight. Pushing hard in this NorCal Tuesday Night or Redland Stage 1 race. B. Kellison about 20 yards off the leader's wheel. Pulling back in, slowly but surely. Going to catch the wheel of our first place rider, B. Richwine. And take advantage of that draft maybe for a bit. A little under seven and a half miles in for these leaders. Six and a half to go. Both of them taking advantage of this nice downhill section. Doing a little... Aerodynamic coasting there. Great riding so far by all of our racers. Feel definitely kind of spread out when we got to that climb area of this first lap. Before that it was tight. First seven positions, all within about five yards of each other. We're heading back down the first part of the course that we rode on the first lap. All downhill, and then we do an uphill, and then we'll be heading to the finish. Eight miles complete, six to go for these front runners. B. Richwine in first, B. Kellison in second. Right on B. Richwine's wheel. Let's see how much he's saving by being in the draft. Looks like about 60 watts riding on his wheel. As he moves closer, he will, may, he will gain more savings and wattage. And you can kind of see that up in the status display right now. He's pulling in. He's saving about 150 watts, which is amazing. B. 
B. Kellison pulling out front. B. Richwine responding and not letting him do it. B. Kellison taking advantage of the downhill and drafting and coasting a little bit. Saving a little energy for the finish. Look at him jump in there. This is what I mean about RGT cycling. Great bicycle physics and dynamics. You don't see this in other platforms where the drafting is so realistic. Where you see B. Kelson is not putting out any wattage and zero cadence and hanging right on the leader's wheel. Fantastic physics here on this virtual cycling platform. And look at B. Kelson's heart rate coming down. What a fit individual. Perfect draft. Hanging about maybe six inches off B. Richwine's wheel. And look, saving 300 plus watts. Amazing strategy here by B. Kellison. Saving lots of energy for that climb to the finish. Let's see if it pays off for B. Kellison. See what strategy uh, B. Richwine might have as we start up the hill here shortly. But you can see B. Kellison still in the coast mode and hanging right on B. Richwine's wheel. Amazing. And this is the way it would be in real life, too, folks. You get in, suck somebody's wheel, and you save a lot of energy. And if he pulled out beside of him, you'd, it's like hitting a brick wall with the wind. And he'd have to start pedaling and putting out 300 plus watts to stay and maintain. Awesome, awesome. We'll take a side view of this to show you what it looks like on the side. And you see B. Kelson now starting to pedal a little bit as the downhill is kind of subsiding and still saving a lot of wattage being in that draft, but not enough to maintain as we are now on an uphill. Watching our first place leader, B. Richwine. Second place, B. Kellison. Third place, J. Bay. Fourth place, Peanut. Fifth, D. Connolly. Sixth, Tristan Witt and D. Bodke right there, sixth and seventh. Shane in eighth. M. Waugh in ninth. M. Saccone, tenth. C. Quinar in... 11th, J Valley in 12th, R Guerrero in 13th, J Giannone in 14th. Get past all these bots and we'll check out and see how April's doing back here. In 15th, doing a great job. She's on that, still on that uphill section, pushing hard. Doing a great job. Back up front with B. Callison. Now in the lead. B. Richline in the draft. Jumping out front again. Got a little rest and flex the leg muscles. There's B. Callison jumping back out front. Again, you're watching live coverage of the NorCal Tuesday Nighter, the Redlands Series, Stage 1, Crafton Hills Race. Almost 11 miles complete for these front runners. Three to go. Getting ready to start heading up the incline, the hill to the finish. Long, gradual, drawn-out climb. Getting steeper as we get closer to the finish. Doing our turnaround again. And heading back home. A 
Again, we'll go down our leaderboard. B. Richwine first, B. Kellis in second, J. Bay third, P. Nutt in fourth, D. Connolly in fifth, D. Bodke in sixth, Tristan Witt in seventh, Shane in eighth, M. Wall in ninth, M. Sico in tenth. Great racing by all of our racers. Got a great field out here tonight for this NorCal Tuesday Nighter. About a 3% climb now. B. Richwine back out front. B. Kellison in a close second. About 15 yards, 20 yards back right now from our first place rider. I'm watching live coverage of the NorCal Tuesday Nighter live on V Cycling News. Watching our first place rider in tonight's race right now, B. Richwine. B. Kellison in a second right now, about 80 yards back. 2% climb, going to get steeper as we get closer to the finish. Go ahead and run back to our people. Again, B. Richwine in first. B. Kellison in second. J. Burbay in third. Peanut in fourth. D. Bodke in fifth. D. Connolly in sixth. Tristan Witt in seventh. Riding as a group right there, helping each other out, maybe trying to reel in fourth place. Shane in 8th, M. Waugh in ninth, M. Saccone in 10th, C. Quinar in 11th, J. Valley and R. Guerrero, 12th and 13th, riding together, working together great. J. Giannone in 14th. And back to April in 15th. Only female out there in tonight's race. Back up front with B. Richwine. Now a tenth mile over B. Kellison. Climbing hard out of here. 350 plus watts. Pushing hard. Definitely brought his climbing legs tonight. Pushing hard. Maintaining that wattage, and you can see on the graph below his numbers up there in the left-hand corner of the screen, pretty flat on his wattage, all right around 300, 350. So excellent racing tonight by B. Richwine. Wonderful cadence being that high up in the wattage, and decent heart rate, low to mid zone one, 159 right now. Great athletes, all of these racers, definitely in shape. Take a look, B. Kellison second. A little over a tenth mile back now. About a 3% climb. Putting out the wattage, 400 plus watts. Nice cadence. Heart rate coming up on this climb. Back up front would be which one? And again, our group is kind of spread out due to the uh, climbing sections of this course. Second time we've climbed this area tonight. This is the second out and back. A little over a mile and a third to the finish line for B. Richwine. Tenth of a mile over second, B. Kellison. Half mile back to Jaber Bay. Then a little over a mile back to Peanut, D. Conley, and Tristan Witt, D. Bodke. 
and Shane all back there working hard. Beaver Twine doing a great job tonight. Has stayed up front since the start. First half of the race, we, well, first quarter of the race, we had a nice group of about seven riders, all within about 10 yards of each other. And that first climb area kind of broke us apart. A mile to go for Beaver at Rich Wine. Still about a tenth of a mile over B. Kellison. Nine tenths climbing left for B. Rich Wine. Doing a great job putting out the wattage. Still staying very consistent in the three, mid three to high three, 100 watts. Great cadence, 100, 100 on the cadence. Heart rate staying right around 160 ish. Doing a great, great job tonight. Impressive ride. Go back and take a look at B. Kellison. Also doing a great job. Putting out 400 plus watts and staying very steady. Again, 77 on the cadence. Nice heart rate coming up on this climb. Great racing. By all these athletes. Very impressive ride tonight by every one of them. Climbing to the finish is never fun. But it seems like no matter where we are, we always are doing that. Climbing to the end. A little over a half mile to go for B. Richwine, U.S. rider. Keeping it going. Half a mile to go. B. Kellison has got about six tenths to go. About a tenth mile back from the leader. And then third is about a half a mile back from second place right now. Climbing to the top here and then flat to the finish. Four tenths. Very impressive ride by all of our racers tonight. Racing here on RGTCycling.com on the NorCal Tuesday Nighter Redland Series Stage One Crafton Hills live coverage on B Cycling News. Three tenths to go for our leader, B Rich Wine. And then four tenths for our second place, B. Kellison, doing a great job tonight. Two tenths to go. One tenth of the finish will be Rich Wine. Pushing hard to the finish. Keeping that wattage up there. Gained a little bit up in the 400 watts. Pushing hard to the finish. Awesome. Great job. And the winner is... B. Richwine in tonight's race. Congratulations. Let's take a look at our second place rider. Two tenths out, B. Kellison. Great job by our winner tonight, B. Richwine. B. Kellison a little under a tenth of a mile to go to the finish. 
Keep it going. Awesome. Pushing hard to the finish. 600 plus watts. Great job, B. Kellison. Our second place rider tonight. Back to our third place rider, Jay Bay. Pushing hard to the finish. About a half a mile to go for Jay Bay. And again, we want to congratulate first place, B. Richwine. Second place, B. Kellison so far. On tonight's NorCal Tuesday Night or Redland Stage 1, Crafton Hills. Four tenths to go for a third place rider. Great, great racing tonight on the NorCal Tuesday Nighter. Three tenths left for Jaber Bay. He keeps us up. We'll be on the podium in third place and joining B. Richwine that came in first and B. Kellison who came in second. And again, Jaber Bay has picked up the wattage a little bit here towards the end. Upwards of 300 watts. Two tenths to go. Pushing hard to the finish. Not giving up. Going to take that third spot. Jay Bay in two tenths of a mile. Almost to the top of the hill. Then it's going to flatten out for him towards the finish. Two tenths. One tenth left. Three hundred plus watts still. Heart rate up there in the one sixties. Great job. Congratulations to our third place rider, Jay Bay, coming across the finish line in 40 yards. Congratulations. Back to fourth place right now, D. Connolly. Again, let's take a look at our podium. First place, B. Richwine. Second place, B. Kellison. Third, J. Brubay. And tonight's NorCal Tuesday Nighter, Redland, Stage 1, Crafton Hills. Back to our fourth place rider, D. Connolly, the mastermind of this series. Four tenths to go. We really appreciate everything he does for this series. And at the beginning you saw the, uh, I think, I may not have played it tonight because I was in a hurry. Uh, but he always gives us the relive of the actual course. The flyover. We really appreciate that. Four tenths to go for D. Connolly. And one of the ones we normally have on the live rider cams consistently. We really appreciate that. That'll be back next week. And if you want to join the live rider cams, shoot me a message on Facebook, and we'll send you the info to be able to do that and show you in real life on your trainer in your pain cave racing the NorCal series. Two tenths left to go for Dan. Awesome race tonight. Awesome ride. Two tenths left. Still on a 6% climb. Awesome effort. Pushing hard. One tenth left for Dan. Slowly flattening out to the finish. Right at about a 1%, 2% climb right now. 4%. Last little bitty hill.
90 yards left to go for Dan. And he will be our fourth place tonight in the NorCal Tuesday Nighter Redlands Stage 1 Crafton Hills Race. Congratulations, Dan, on a great fourth place finish. Back to Peanut, who is in fifth. And we see back there Tristan Witt in a close sixth, about 70 yards back. In the red zone right now, maybe trying to close that gap down. Only has a tenth of a mile to do it, though. Peanut picking the pace up a little bit. Looks like Peanut's going to come across the line in fifth place tonight. Great, great effort. Pushing hard to the finish. 450 plus watts right to the end. Congratulations, Peanut. Fifth place tonight. Got Tristan Witt close. Coming across to end sixth. Great job. Back to D. Bodke in seventh. Again, close, 100 yards out. Congratulations, D. Bodke, doing a great job tonight. Going to come across in seventh place in tonight's NorCal Tuesday Nighter. Congratulations, D. Bodke. Back to M. Waugh in eighth right now, about a tenth to go. Those hill spreader riders out a bit. Still close. Nice finishing. Mainly all together here. Within a good, good close distance. Congratulations, Emma. Going to come across in 8th position. 30 yards. Eighth place goes to Emma. Back to Shane in ninth. Tenth of a mile to go. Pushing hard, doing a great race night chain. U.S. Rider. Had a good mix tonight of countries showing up. M. Sacone going to come across in tenth place. Great race tonight. Shane coming across in ninth in 15 yards. Congratulations, Shane. M. Sacone in 10th, about 100 yards out. M. Sacone going to come across in 10th position. Great racing, pushing hard, 300 plus watts to the finish. Congratulations. Back to C. Quinar. I'm hoping I'm pronouncing that right. If I'm not, please correct me in the comments. I apologize. Four tenths to go. Going to come across in 11th position. And we've got... Uh, Jay Valley, about a tenth of a mile back, in 12th, going to come across after C. Quinar. Great racing, three tenths to go, going to come across in 11th position in tonight's NorCal Tuesday Nighter, Redland Stage 1, Crafton Hills Race. Part of a new thing on NorCal Tuesday Nighter. The Redland Stage Races. Three tenths to go. And live coverage here every Tuesday night on V Cycle News, 9.05 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time right now. 
You can join us live every week. Head out to the uh, social media pages for Recycling News. Like, subscribe, and ring that bell and follow to get updates on the NorCal events as well as many, many others we cover live, both here in the States and overseas, all on the RGT Cycling platform. Two tenths to go for our 11 position sequin R. Almost to that second little steep little climb to the finish before it flattens out right at the finish. Impressive effort by all of our riders and racers tonight. About 100 yards left. And we'll watch our 11th position, C. Quinar, come across the finish line in tonight's NorCal Tuesday Nighter. Redland Stage 1, Crafton Hills. Live on V-Cycling News. Congratulations, C. Quinar, 11th position. Great, great job. Back to 12th, J. Valley pushing hard across. Going to come across in 12th place here in 30 yards. Congratulations, Jay Valley. 12th place in tonight's NorCal Tuesday Nighter. Back to 13th position, Jay Giannone. 7 tenths out. Again, want to congratulate all of our racers tonight for coming out and joining us on the NorCal Tuesday Nighter Series, the Redland Stage Races. You're watching Stage 1 live on V-Cycling News. A little over a half mile left for J.G. and Owen. Can I come across in 13th position? Pushing hard to the finish. Still a little over a half mile left for JG and Owen. On the climb right now towards the finish. Half mile to go.
You're watching our 13th place rider, Jay Gianone, three tenths out from the finish on tonight's NorCal Tuesday Nighter. Redland Series Stage 1 Crafting Hills Race. It's a 14 mile course, a little over 1300 feet of climb. Two laps of this out and back downhill uphill course. Two tenths left for our 13th place finisher. Jay Giannone doing a great race tonight as well as all of our other racers did. Appreciate all of them coming out and joining in on the NorCal Tuesday Nighter Series. We'll be back here next Tuesday night with Stage 2 at 9.05 Eastern Daylight Time for another great race Live coverage on B-Cycling News. Be sure to join us. One tenth to go for our 13th position, Jay Giannone. Staying relatively steady towards the finish. Doing a great job. Hundred yards to go for Jay Giannone. In that little steep section right before the finish line. 8%, almost 9% climb. And on the TT bike, he's on pretty tough. 60 yards to go. Congratulations, JJ Nolan. 13th place in here. Let's jump back to the only woman in the field tonight, April Regal, doing a great job. A little over a mile to go for April, pushing hard on that climb towards the finish line. Watching April Regal, going to be our 14th place finisher tonight. And it's a little confusing because it shows her in 20th, 26th position on the little flag above her head right now. But that's because of all the uh, pacer bots we have in the race. But she's actually going to come across in 14th position. First place woman. One mile to go for April, doing a great job tonight. In that climb section of the finish. Second time around on this climbing area. Doing a great job. Pushing hard. A little under a mile to go for April. 13 miles done. Unfortunately, the last little bit is the tough part, the climb out to the finish. This is a great race course tonight. It's 14 miles of out and back, two laps. A nice downhill, then back up after a turnaround two times. Nine tenths to go for April. April's in that five percent climb area right now. Eight tenths to go for April.
pushing hard. We want to thank everybody for watching live out here on Bicycling News. And we want to also thank you if you're watching the replay. And be sure out there on social media to like, subscribe, follow, ring that bell, show your appreciation, and get all the updates on all the coverage that we provide on RGT Cycling races and events. Seven tenths to go for April. Going to come across in 14th position overall. First place woman. April's working hard climbing this hill. Heart rate way up there in the 150s. Pushing hard. 7% climb right now. But definitely going to finish. Pushing hard to the end. Up in the red zone again. Pushing, pushing, pushing. Trying to finish this climb to the finish going to flatten out a little bit here shortly for not quite as steep for a little bit six percent climb right now and again you're watching the finish of the NorCal Tuesday Nighter Redland Stage 1 Crafton Hills race first in a multi-stage race here on RGT Cycling and V Cycling News we will cover live every Tuesday night, 9.05 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. Watch all the exciting racing. April's almost there. Half a mile to go. Doing a great job tonight. Only woman in tonight's field. Got to come across in 14th place overall, first place woman. She's challenging all the other women riders out there to come join the NorCal Tuesday Night Series on RGT Cycling. Come out and join April Race, all these guys. Come on. The more racers, the better. Four tenths to go for April. Thirteen and six tenths in. Four tenths to go. Five percent climb right now. She's pushing hard. And again, we want to thank all the racers out here tonight for joining the NorCal Tuesday Nighter. Had some new faces that I hadn't seen before, which is awesome. We always want new riders out here. Head over to rgtcycling.com, download the app, sign up for free. Search for NorCal in the events tab and join up and race with these fellow racers. This is going to be a great stage race series the Redlands on the NorCal Tuesday Nighter and again this is stage one it's a 14 mile course about 1300 feet overall climb two laps of this out and back course very great racing tonight had a great group up front of seven riders 
till about a quarter of the way in when we started back up to the other side of the first lap and then we kind of broke apart but we all finished relatively decent at the end with a good distance of each other so that just shows you what kind of racers these are great racing on tonight's live coverage on V-Cycling News of the NorCal Tuesday Nighter Series. Two tenths to go for April. Pushing hard to the finish. Awesome riding. And again, we appreciate all you live viewers as well as you replay viewers on V-Cycling News. One tenth to go for April. Kind of in this flat, flatter area, not really flat. Going to come up to this little steep section right before the finish. 100 yards to go for April. Going to come across in 14th position. First place woman. Congratulations, April at 90 yards. Fifty yards for April. Oh, picking it up, pushing hard to the finish line. Sees that finish, going hard towards it. Congratulations, April, on a great race tonight. Again, here's our podium for tonight's Stage One Redlands Stage Race Series, Crafton Hills, on the NorCal Tuesday Nighter. First position was B. Richwine. Second was B. Kellison. Third, J. Brubay. Congratulations to all of our racers tonight. Great riding, great finishing by all that started. We didn't have anybody drop out. Congratulations to everybody. And again, thanks for watching live coverage on V-Cycling News. We'll see you next week.